Robert Morris Women's Lacrosse takes the field with purpose on Sunday, October 25th. The Colonial Classic Hope for the Cure tournament is in its 10th year. The annual Youth and High School Lacrosse 7 on 7 has been a benefit for a variety of charities throughout the years, but none more dear to the RMU program than Huntington's disease. Head coach Katie Phillips' mother, Marion Phillips, was diagnosed with Huntington's disease late in life, and after battling for years, she passed away. The family was unaware that this neurological disease existed in the family line and was surprised by the diagnosis. Coach Phillips spends much of her time working to not only fundraise for the cause, but to educate people on this disease. Here's her story. She was diagnosed very late in the symptomatic process of Huntington's disease, as I've learned since. She was diagnosed after we noticed a bunch of relatively odd symptoms. They were stroke-like, they mimicked mental health. Uh, she was starting to lose the ability to take care of herself. A lot of paranoia symptoms. And again, the movements and the, di the, the similarities to stroke led us to believe that something was neurological. I think the interesting part is, is that knowing that Huntington's is in your family in such a late time frame, it makes you really look back to the last 30 years. If I think about what the doctors and what the support group uh, has told me in terms of symptoms and things to look for, I look back now and think there was a lot of telltale signs. Had we known Huntington's was in our family line, we may have come to that conclusion earlier. Uh, but she, you know, again, not knowing whether or not either of my grandparents had it or anybody in her extended family. It was just not something we looked for until very late in the game. Join RMU Women's Lacrosse on Sunday, October 25th at Joe Walton Stadium as teams from around the region play for the cure.